Let's create a Google Hangout on Air. The difference between a regular Google Hangout and a Hangout on Air is that the one that's on Air will automatically be recorded and uploaded onto YouTube. So before we start, make sure that you have a Google account such as a Gmail account or a Google Plus account. Next, make sure that the YouTube channel that's associated with those accounts has been created and verified. So go to your Google Plus page by going to plus.google.com or from your Gmail, you can access Google Plus over here and then finding the G Plus icon. From the Google Plus page, find the home tab, the home area, and then a drop down will appear. Select Hangouts. Now you'll be taken to the Hangouts page. From this page, select the Hangouts on Air tab and then create a Hangout on Air. Give it a name, a description, a starting time, and insert any email addresses of people who you want to invite. I really suggest that um, when you invite people, do it right before you know the Hangout is going to start because that's the easiest way for them to join. And I'll make a separate video on this later. But um, once you have that information input, Select Share, and you will be taken to a page that shows um, how to access your Google Hangout. If for some reason you um, decide to schedule your Hangout um, at a ver at a later time, and then you come back, you might see a page. You might see your Google Plus page, and it might look something like this. For these Hangouts, you are unable to access it because this play button will only lead you to the end product, which is the final recorded video that's been uploaded. So the best way to access your Hangout on Air is to create it right away and press the Start button. Or if you're looking for it, from your drop-down, select Events that you've scheduled and find the specific Hangout on Air that you've scheduled and then you'll be taken back to this page. When you're ready, select Start and your Hangout on Air will be ready to be recorded. I highly recommend that right before you record, you invite guests one more time because the invitation process is a little bit strange. The best way for them to join the Hangout is right before it starts um, because they receive a notification pop-up from their from their Google account. So enter in the guest emails and if you need to you go up to this button one more time and invite people and when everyone is ready um, a start broadcast button will appear on the bottom of the screen and then you can start your broadcast right here.